Hello everybody, Manix here. Sorry about the creases in the background here, but it's going to be an ultra fast video. I'm going to be talking about the ring lock on the Openol knife right here. Ring locks are used in other knives and such, but most commonly, a lot of people know them for is the Openol. It's basically just the metal bolster they have around the wooden handle right here that you can manually rotate in place. And boom. There you go. There's no spring on it or anything. It keeps it in place. There's a little bit of play. It's not the most efficient locking mechanism, but as it wears, you can continue to rotate it, so you have actually a really long life bar on there. Not that it will wear terribly fast, because you're probably not using this for very difficult cutting tasks, and the only time it would wear is if you were putting wear on the spine. That's known as negative force, which gets transferred to the ring lock. So this probably is never going to wear on you, and these knives are dirt cheap, by the way, like around the $10 range. This happens to be an open number 9. So it's probably never going to one day fail on you as far as that goes as far as having too much wear anyway it's also nice about the ring lock is that there's also a cutout on this one you can also rotate it to keep it locked in the closed position too if you needed to do that because there's no detent on this blade very old-fashioned very simple functional design so i'm very classy about it i do like it now if, if there was like a spring ring lock that could work if you get like a spring in there and a more tactical design folder just have it spring into place but it would be slightly difficult to disengage it you have to kind of hold it in place and then drop the edge towards directly directly towards your thumb while you're closing it so maybe that's why that's not really a thing but it, it's just a very very simple design that's very functional it's not very strong but a knife like this with a wooden handle and a carbon steel blade like this you don't really need a strong design so there you go that's the ring lock just thought i'd throw it into the collection of locking mechanism videos i have